Jeffy, woo. what are you doing? I'm being a police car. Woo, 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 woo. Well, stop being a police car. All right, well, I'm a police officer, so give me your license and registration. I'm not even driving. Well, I have to do a cavity search to open up your butthole. No. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Let go of my butt. Hey there. Real cops, what are you doing here? Well, I'm a cop. I can pretty much walk into any house I want. Not without a warrant. No, warrant, schmorrant. I had probable cause. What was your probable cause? I don't know. It smelled like weed or something. I'll figure it out. Listen, I need your help. With what? Well, you see, I have a lot of jobs, but I'm also a security guard at this kid's pizza place. It's called Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. Maybe you've heard of it? No. Oh, shut up. I know you've played the games. There's a movie coming out. You've definitely heard of it. No. Listen, you keep lying to me and I'm gonna pop you, okay? All right, so I usually work there with my partner, and he worked last night, but I haven't seen him since, and I'm pretty sure he just disappeared, so I need a new partner, and I was wondering if maybe you'd help me. What, me? Become a security officer? Nah. But Marvin, you're the only person I know who'd look good in a security guard uniform. Well, you're gonna have to find someone else, because I don't look good in one. Wait, you're already kind of wearing a security guard uniform. Well, I'm actually a police officer. Wait, so you're impersonating a police officer? I could arrest you for that. But I won't. Instead, I want you to come be my partner. But I want you to be a real police officer! Well, being a security guard is kind of like being a real police officer, except you don't carry a gun, and no one respects you, and you make way less money. You're basically the substitute teacher of police officers. Well, just do it, Jeffy. Yeah, you make $11 an hour. All right, I'll do it for one hour, because I just want $11 so I can get some V-Bucks. Okay, come on. All right, Jeffy, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. Can I have some pizza? No, 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 it's not your lunch break yet. Now, first I want to show you around so you know where everything is. See, right here we have the main stage, and these are the animatronics. We got Bonnie, Freddy, and Chica. Yeah, see, they don't work because this place got shut down a while back because some kid got eaten. They never really figured out what ate the kid, but you know how it is. One kid gets eaten, and it ruins the fun for everybody, so they just decided to shut the whole place down. I guess they still wanted to pay for security because apparently the animatronics are expensive, and they don't want anyone breaking in and stealing them, but honestly, this job is pretty cake. I mean, it's the same shit every night. I just sit back in the security room. Any questions? While you were talking, Freddy scratched his balls. No, he didn't. He's an animatronic. He didn't even have balls. I saw with my eyes Freddy scratch his balls. Oh, he's not plugged in. You're just hallucinating. Come on, I want to show you the security office. I know I saw you scratch your balls. Hey, he's moving again! No, he's not. Come on. All right, Jeffy, this is the security room. Honestly, there's no reason to ever leave this room. All we have to do is just sit here and watch the security camera where nothing ever happens and just eat stale pizza. But you told me I couldn't have pizza. Well, that was earlier. Now you can have pizza. But first, I want to show you all the security camera angles. See, right here, this is the hallway for walking. And right here, this is the kitchen. You know, that's where the pizza gets made. Just the kitchen. And then right here is the bathroom. I don't really know why there's a camera in the bathroom at a kid's pizza place. You know what, maybe it's for the best this place got shut down. And that's the main stage again, so hand me some za. Wait, the animatronics aren't there! No, what now? The animatronics aren't there anymore! Huh, yeah, they sure aren't, are they? I told you they were moving! Oh, well, maybe the security camera's just glitching. Let's go check it out. Okay, let's see what's going on. Oh, yeah, I forgot it's dark. Let me get a flashlight. Whoa! Hey, Freddy! I told you he could move! Oh, I see what's going on here. Okay, it's your first day on the job and you're trying to prank the veteran. Ha ha, you got me. I didn't move him! He moved on his own! He can't move on his own. Yes, he can! Look, just help me get him back on stage. Huh? Ugh, okay, kid, where are Bonnie and Chica? I didn't move him! Oh, my God, kid, I just want to go back to the office and eat stale pizza. I don't have time for this. Well, I didn't move him! Okay, fine. No pizza for you. I'm gonna go back to the office and check the cameras to see where you hid them. Alright, kid, let's see where you hit them. Not the whole way. Oh, great, you hit Chica in the kitchen. No, I did it! Oh, great, and you hit Bonnie in the bathroom. Very funny. I'm not moving him! Just help me round him up. <sighs> I can't believe you hit Bonnie in the bathroom. What if he got stained? It would never come out of that purple felt. Let's go get him. Whoa! I thought you were closer to the toilet. I told you they're moving! They're not moving, come on. Okay, Bonnie's back. Now let's go get Chica out of the kitchen so I can enjoy my pizza. Okay, and Chica should be right there. Yeah, let's grab her. <sighs> okay, they're all back now. Now, kid, no more touching them. I haven't been touching them! Well, you shouldn't touch them because if you break one of them, you're gonna have to work for free for a whole year because they're so expensive. Now let's go back and eat pizza. All right, Jeffy, hand me a slice of pizza. Oh, man, I love pepperoni. You see, Jeffy, when you don't mess with me, this job is really easy. All you have to do is sit here, eat pizza, play games on your phone, check the cameras every now and then, but what the hell was that? They're gone, and I know you didn't move them because you were standing right here, and the static only lasted half a second. That's what I've been trying to tell you! Okay, let's see where they are. Take a look. 
Okay, not in the hallway. What? Oh, Chica's getting a snack. Okay then, I'll just keep looking. Look. Oh, and Bonnie's taking a shit. I didn't know animatronics could take a shit. I wonder how that works. Okay, well, oh, Freddy's back on stage. That's good, we don't have to worry about him. That helps a lot. Oh, Chica's got a slice of pizza. Well, at least she looks happy. Okay, oh, and Bonnie's done shitting. I wonder if he washed his hands. Okay, let's... Oh, wow, Chica's really enjoying that pizza, huh? W wait, J Jeffy, do you hear stomping like the pitter-patter of fox feet? Yeah, I do! Let me take a look. Oh, close the door, close the door, close the door, close the door! Lock it, lock it, lock it, lock it, lock it! Oh, God, I forgot about Foxy. Who's Foxy? That's Foxy. That's the one that can move. So if you knew that one can move, then you should have known that they all can move! Well, I didn't know that, but it makes sense now. Come on, let's check the cameras to see what Foxy's doing. All right, let's take a look here. Oh shit, the laptop's out of power. What does that mean? Well, it means we can't look at the goddamn cameras. What does that mean? Well, it means we don't know where they are. What does that mean? It means they could be anywhere. What does that mean? It means we're gonna have to get a flashlight and go out there and look. Capital, fuck that! Foxy's right outside the door! Well, he can't still be there, right? I mean, he's not just gonna stand there all day. Well, I think we should stay in this room all night! Well, that wouldn't be very much of a video now, would it? No, it wouldn't. So come on. All right, Jeffy, open the door. No, you open the door. I want to stay here in the room. You're the one that wants you to go out there so bad. Well, I guess you got me there. Okay, let's see. Uh, well, I don't see him, so I think we're good. Yeah, come on. All right, let's take a look in here. Well, looks like the power's out everywhere, but I don't see him. Oh, and great. Freddy's not on stage anymore. Well, let's go look for him. I want to leave. No, we can't leave. We have to stay here till 6 a.m. and we don't get paid. And we got to put all the animatronics back on stage or my boss is going to be pissed. Come on. All right, Jeffy, let's check the kitchen. Ah! Oh, shit. Jeffy, I dropped the flashlight. Could you get it? Okay. Uh, hey, Chica. <laughs> well, now that I know you can move, I'm not going to carry your heavy ass back on stage. So could you just walk back on stage, please? Okay, well, I definitely can't make you, so I guess I'll just let you think about it. Oh, uh, the flashlight broke. Okay, just let's get the hell out of here. All right, Jeffy, here's the plan. We're gonna go back to the office and grab my car keys so we can get the hell out of here. But first, I gotta go to the bathroom, because I'm pretty sure I pissed my pants when I saw Chica, and I think maybe even a little bit of shit squirted out my ass. I mean, it happens when you're scared and you're 40, you know? Yeah, I understand. I do it for fun all the time. Yeah, see, you get it, but I, I really do need to check, so I'm just gonna... Go in here. Oh my god, more came out. Uh, hi, Bonnie. Yeah, y you are really scary, but is it okay if I check my underwear, please? No? Okay, well, I I'll just I'll just leave you to it then, buddy. Sorry for bothering you. Okay, let's go to the office. Okay, Jeffy, I'm gonna grab my keys real quick. Oh, look. What? Oh, shit. Foxy's back. Oh, no, he's stretching. He is getting ready to run. He can run the 40-yard dash in three seconds. Oh no, oh no, we gotta go, we gotta go, 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 Close it, close it, close it, lock it, lock it, lock it! Oh god. Okay, let me get my keys and let's get the fuck out of here. But, Jeffy, where are my keys? I don't know. They were right here. Well, I haven't seen them. Well, keys don't just disappear. Jeffy, do you hear the jingling of keys? Yeah. Uh, Jeffy, do you see those big goofy bare feet? Yeah, I do. Uh, person behind the curtain, do you have my keys? I'll take that as a yes. Oh god, I know I have to pull the curtain back, but I really don't want to. Oh, and now the lights went out. Now I really, really don't want to. Oh, and now it's playing the You're Fucked music. Now I really, really, really don't want to. Oh shit, it's Freddy and he looks pissed off. Uh, Freddy, can I have my keys? No? Okay. Uh, Jeffy, you know what? I say we kick his ass! Yeah! Yeah, it's 2v1! <laughs> oh, okay! Yeah, I'm gonna turn you into Freddy Fast Bitch! Yeah, let's get him! Get him! Just get him! Check his ass! Check his ass! Suck that! These are my car keys! Oh, okay, Jeffy, Jeffy, I think, I think. Jeffy, I think we spit on him enough. We can get out of here. Jeffy, let's just get to the car, get the hell out of here, and never come back to this place ever again. Does that sound like a plan? Yeah. Uh, wait, what the hell was that? <laughs> oh, shit!
shit. Hey, Bonnie. And Chica's right there. Oh, I see what's going on here. They're mad that we jumped a boy. Well, guess what, Bonnie? Freddy went out like a bitch. Yeah, and he got spit on. Yeah, a lot. Like, more than I actually condone. So if you see him, please tell him we're sorry. Okay, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna beat up Bonnie. You take Chica. No, I'm gonna beat up Bonnie and you take Chica. Well, see, here's the problem with that. I don't want to deal with that mouth. It scares me. I don't want to deal with the mouth either. Okay, well, how about this? Not it. Aww. Oh, oh, Chica's giving us the bird. <laughs> that pisses me off. Why does that piss you off so much? Because I don't have a middle finger, so I can't do that. So this is what's gonna happen. You go start the car, and I beat both their asses. Sounds like a plan. Now, who wants him, Jeffy? But before I beat your ass, I'm gonna let you know that my body is a dangerous weapon. <laughs> oh, hell yeah, bumping some tunes. <laughs> No, Foxy's chasing me! Oh, shit! Okay, Jeffy, I think we finally outran him. Now let's go get some McDonald's and go home. Ah! Marvin, how do you think Jeffy's doing at his new job? Baby, he's doing fine. It's the easiest job in the world. He's not even a cop. He's a security officer. All he has to do is sit down all day and look at cameras. It's easy. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Are you gonna ask what happened? Well, did you get off your job early? Well, no, we were almost killed! Yeah, the animatronics came to life and tried to kill us! So then I had to beat some ass! Yeah, he did. Wait, what? Well, yeah, remember that pizzeria I told you about that's kinda like Chuck E. Cheese? Well, that turns out all the animatronics are haunted and they all tried to kill us. But then Jeffy kicked all their asses. But then as we were driving away, the Fox one Foxy popped up in our back seat. And we thought he was gonna eat us. But it turns out he's actually a pretty cool dude. He just wanted us to drop him off at his cousin's house. Oh, so is Jeffy fired? Oh, no. No, no, no. No, he's just not going to go back there ever, ever again. You know, unless this video does really well, you know, maybe we'll go back for another night. So if you guys just like and subscribe and get our numbers up, you know, maybe we'll go back with some different animatronics next time. Like, like that puppet boy or the, the balloon fucker. Okay, Jeffy, here's your peas and here's your coke. Jeffy! <sighs> Jeffy, just eat all your peas, okay? But I don't want chocolate cake, Danny. You can get chocolate cake if you finish all your peas. Promise? Yes, yes, I promise, Jeffy. Just finish all your peas. Put your stupid coke out there, get your stupid coke. You know, I'll, I'll just leave it. Um, Danny, all done. You're all done? Yeah. What? I ate all my peas, Danny. Are you sure it's not on the floor, Jeffy? Nope, not on the floor. I, See, told you not on the floor. I guess I guess you did eat all your peas. Wait. Hey. J Jeffy, move. No. Jeffy! What? You burned all your seat, Jeffy! Chocolate cake, please. You, you're not getting any chocolate cake, Jeffy! <laughs> but you promised! You promised I can have chocolate cake! You promised! You promised! You Shut promised. up, Jeffy! I said only if you ate all your peas. You're not getting any chocolate cake. Since you're being a bad boy, Jeffy, I'm gonna eat chocolate cake in front of you. What? Jeffy? Where'd he go? Jeffy! Jeffy, where'd you go? What? Jeffy? Jeffy, unlock the door! Jeffy! You unlock that door right now! Jeffy! You put that chocolate cake back! Jeffy! Jeffy! Oh, I'm gonna kill him! I'm gonna... Jeffy! Unlock the door! Jeffy! Jeffy, unlock the door! Jeffy! Jeffy, unlock the door! Jeffy, unlock the door right now! What am I gonna do? The front door. I can go to the front door! Jeffy! 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 No! Jeffy! Unlock the door, Jeffy! Let me inside my house, Jeffy! Nope. Okay, what am I gonna do? The garage! The garage! No! No! Jeffy! 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 Oh my god! What am I gonna do? There's a window! There's a window open! Oh yeah! Oh, when I get up there, I'm gonna kill him. Hey, Donnie, what are you doing? Jeffy! What? Let me inside the house! No. What? You, you better not close that window, Jeffy. Why? Uh, because I, I have to take my medicine. It, I, I, it's really important. You don't take medicine, Donnie. Yes, I do, Jeffy! Jeffy! Oh! Jeffy! Oh my god! Oh. I hate him so much. What are you doing, buddy? 
excuse me, officer. I, I'm just uh, trying to get inside my house, you know. Inside your house? Yeah. Well, why don't you just use the front door? B because my uh, retarded roommate locked me out. Really? Sounds like you got a grudge against somebody, huh? Can you get that light out of my eyes? No. Have you been drinking? Huh? Maybe, maybe a DUI? Well, I haven't been driving or drinking. Yeah, we'll see about that. Um, so this is your house? Yes, huh? th this is this is my house, and I'm just locked out. So can you help me uh, get in? Mm. Well, we'll go see. Come on. He's not gonna answer. We'll try the doorbell. The doorbell? Yeah. See what difference it's gonna make. Yep, see, that's what it was. <laughs> um, can I help you? Uh, yeah, excuse me, sir. Jimmy, help me in! Whoa, 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 what do you think you're doing? Oh. You can't just go barging into this man's house. It's my house! Well, we'll see about that. Uh, excuse me, sir, I, I don't mean to bother you. Oh, yeah, you are. Oh, well, I'll, I'll yeah. try to make this quick. Um, does Good. he live here? Him? Uh, yeah, th th does he live here? Um, I've never seen him before in my life, officer. Oh, really? Yep. Uh, oh, Jimmy, you know I live come in! On, come on, Jimmy! Let's go! Ooh, 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 ooh. Come, come on, come on! Come on. I'm gonna right, kill right, him. I'm right, gonna right, kill right, him. All right. Since you don't live here, I'm gonna have to ask you to get off the property. I do live here. Well, we just talked to the owner, and he says you don't. How do you know he's the owner? The man answered the door holding chocolate cake. He's obviously got money. That doesn't mean he's the owner. Well, okay. By the way, you can't go over there anymore. Okay. If I get another call saying that you're over here, you're going to the slammer. All right? What? Drunk bastard. <clears throat> Jenny. Oh, what am I gonna do? It's freezing outside. I gotta get inside the house. The attic. I can go inside the attic. Let me get the ladder. Okay, I'm in the attic. Now, how do I get inside the house? The air vent. The air vent. Yeah. Oh, Jeffy, here I come. And when I see you, I'm gonna punch you in your retarded face. I hate you, Jeffy. Oh, I hate you. Oh my god, I can't wait to kill him. I'm coming for you, Jeffy. I'm coming. Oh my god. When I see him, I'm gonna punch him. I'm almost there. Oh, yeah, there. Whoa. Ah! Oh, what am I gonna do? It's freezing outside. There's a camera. Jerry! Jerry, I know you hear me! Jerry! What? Jerry! Jerry! I know you hear me! Jerry! What? What are you doing, Jerry? Eating chocolate cake? What are you doing, Daddy? I'm freezing my ass off, Jerry! Let me inside! No. Come on, please, Jeffy. I'll do whatever you want. I'll do whatever you want. You'll do whatever I want. Um, well, I do need more chocolate cake, Daddy. You can go get me more chocolate cake, and I'll let you in. Well, after I eat it. Ch chocolate cake? Okay, I'll get you the biggest chocolate cake. Just, I'll be right back. Great. Must be my chocolate cake. Chocolate cake. This is my favorite. Can't wait to eat it. Oh boy. Chocolate cake? What, what is that? What? 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 Unlock the door! No, Jungle Gang Monster! Get, just, just get in the car. I, I know. Just go. I'm not touching you. I know. Breaking news, Gully! A drunk man has just been arrested for trying to break into someone's house while he was covered in chocolate cake! Why are you doing Marvin, Jeffy's gonna be late to school! What? Jeffy, get in here! <laughs> What's up, Daddy? What, Jeffy, you're gonna be late to school. What are you wearing? Well, first of all, Daddy, my name's not Jeffy, it's Jeffy Koo, and this is my Dragon Ball outfit. Dragon Ball outfit? What's a Dragon Ball? Dragon Ball? Because I'm gonna be dragging my balls across your face. What? Jeffy, take that off, you're not wearing it to school. Aw, Marvin, let him wear it! Jeffy, I think orange is your color. Thanks, Mommy. Yeah, orange is his color. It's the color of the jumpsuit he's gonna be wearing in prison when he goes to prison for not being punished as a kid. Jeffy, take that off. No! 
Daddy, I'm not gonna take this off. You get to wear the same outfit all the time and you don't even take a shower. I'm an adult. I can do whatever I want, Jeffy. You're not wearing that to school. Take it off. Daddy, you're not gonna like what I'm gonna do next. What are you doing? See, you got Kai Blast and you didn't even realize. Take it off or you're grounded. You can't ground me, because if you ground me, then I'm gonna Kamehame Akuna Matata you. Kame Akuna Matata! All right, Jeffy, just go to school. All right. All right, Kraus. Today, we're gonna be learning about the brain. Hey, Cody, your mom gave me brain last night. What? Ha, good dude. All right, let's learn parts of the brain. The front of your brain is called the frontal lobe. The back of your brain is called the occipital lobe. And then right here in the middle, you have a hippocampus. Oh, <gasps> there's a campus full of hippos in my brain? No, idiot, that's just what it's called. Teacher, are there hippos in my brain? What's a hippocampus? The hippocampus is where your memories are stored. And a good way to remember that is if there was a hippo on campus, it would be very memorable. Oh. <laughs> you must not have a hippocampus, because you can't remember anything because you're an idiot. Call me an idiot one more time. And the amygdala is the part of your brain that controls your anger. So when you're really, really mad, it's your amygdala. Hey, idiot. Why you getting so mad, idiot? Is your amygdala acting up? Huh? Idiot? 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 <laughs> what the? Come on, Daddy! <laughs> Jesus Christ! What was that? <sighs> uh, Jeffy, are you okay? Jesus Christ, Junior! Dude, his power level is over 9,000! 9,000! What power level? What are you talking about? How do you know his power level? Dude, you don't have a scouter? I never joined the Boy Scouts. Junior, he's going Super Saiyan! Super Satan? No, not Satan! Saiyan! What's he saying? Look at his hair, dude! It's blonde. Yeah! Yeah, the brighter his hair gets, the more powerful he becomes. Yeah, uh, dude! I thought blondes were stupid. No, not if they're male! I'm so confused. Junior, we really just need to get out of here. Yeah, dude! Uh, okay. Oh, Jeffy, you go Super Saiyan? Well, that's no match for my purple finger laser! <gasps> You messed up now. <laughs> oh, Jeffy Koo. Very, very weak Kai Blast. Now prepare for the most powerful purple finger laser you've ever seen. Two in the pink, one in the steam! Oh yeah? Well watch this. Come on, Daddy! <laughs> It's my wife's weakness! You asked for this! What the? Uh, 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 Alright, time to run your lunch like a weird kid! Oh, what is that? Is that a Dragon Ball? Oh, I need six more of these! Hey, Jeffy, how was school today? It was good, Daddy Gook. Wait, what is that? It's a dragon ball, and I just need six more balls. Right now, I only have one ball because I'm like Lance Armstrong. Ooh, Jeffy, earlier today, I found a ball just like that. Gimme see it. Here you go. <gasps> Gimme Gook. F yeah. All right, Daddy, now I got two dragon balls. Now I just need five more. Um, Jeffy, that's only four fingers. Oh, well, just imagine I have one more finger, that's how many more balls I need. I need five more Dragon Balls. Why do you need five more? Because once I get all seven Dragon Balls, I can summon the dragon and he'll grant me a wish. Do you get picked on at school acting like this? Yeah, but I kicked his ass! Jeffy! What, Jeffy, like, do you have friends acting like this? Marvin! I'm being serious, baby, he's acting weird. Daddy, daddy, don't you dare disrespect Dragon Ball Z! This is serious! I just want to make sure you're not getting bullied, you know? Daddy, you're going to make me go Super Saiyan! I'll poop my pants, Daddy. Just don't hurt yourself, Jeffy. All right, Daddy. I'm gonna go look for more Dragon Balls. I just hope this is a phase. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm, my enchiladas are almost done. I sense balls. Oh, there's two more Dragon Balls right there. Hey, you, give me your Dragon Ball. <gasps> no way. No way you can't have my Dragon Balls. I'll destroy the world before I let you have my Dragon Balls. Hand over your balls. Or I'll make you hand them over. I'd like to see you try. All right, you asked for it the hard way. Come in Salada! Salada! You really thought that?
thought you were more powerful than me? Oh, just wait till you see my Gallic gun. It's not more powerful than when I go Super Saiyan. Nani? My nipples are so hard right now. Nipple beam. Nipple beam. That's impossible. Those balls are mine now. Marvin, what was all that noise? I don't know. Check it out, Danny. I got four Dragon Balls. I just need three more to summon the dragon. Jeffy, were you breaking stuff downstairs? No, don't worry about it, Daddy. You don't even understand Dragon Ball Z. But I'm gonna go look for the other three. <laughs> Come on, Ken, it's your turn. Come on, hurry up, just hit one. I smell balls. Oh, there they are. There's two more Dragon Balls right there. Hey, you, hand over your Dragon Balls. Oh, no, you don't. I don't give you consent to grab my balls. Well, they don't belong to you, so hand them over. Oh, you don't want to fight me. I'm too powerful. Not as powerful as me when I go Super Saiyan. Oh, you don't want to see my final form. I'm too hunky. I guess we'll see about that. <laughs> You done messed up now, boy! <laughs> Pathetic. Now I'll show you what true power looks like. <laughs> now you will experience the true power of the dark side. Unlimited power! <laughs> I, 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 I'm too weak. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm hunky as shit. You want to fight? Come on. <laughs> I don't even need to fight you. That's how lame you are. I can get my son to fight you. Jeffy Han, I choose you. Jeffy Han. But what the? Jeffy Han, use Thunderbolt. Jeffy Han. Yeah. yeah, I think that's how that goes. Let's grab these Dragon Balls. On the sixth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me six dragon balls. Oh, you found six? Don't you need one more to make a wish? Precisely, Daddy. I need one more dragon ball to make a wish to the dragon. What are you even going to wish for, Jeffy? You'll see. <laughs> Who's that? Hello? Hey, we got a noise complaint from your neighbors. They said some nerds were fighting in here and yelling. Oh, that's just my son. He's going through a Dragon Ball Z phase. Whoa, no way! <laughs> Kami, Hami, Ha! Oh man, I'm a huge Dragon Ball Z fan. I love it. Not you too. Oh yeah, I've been a fan of it since I was younger. It's great. My son won't stop talking about it. Well, there's a lot to talk about. Who's at the door, Daddy? Oh my God, no way! Where'd you get that outfit? Target. Oh hell yeah, I'm going there right after this. Jeffy, what will make you stop talking about Dragon Ball Z? I'm not going to stop talking about Dragon Ball Z until I collect all the Dragon Balls and summon the dragon. Kid, you're not going to believe this, but I have a Dragon Ball. No way. Oh, Oh yeah, look, I confiscated it from this homeless guy that was trying to smoke it in a spoon. Dang, that's the seven Dragon Ball! That's the last one I need to complete my ball sack! Wait, you have the other six Dragon Balls? Sure do! Oh my god, can I watch you summon the dragon? I don't even care about the witch, I just want to see the dragon. Sure, come on! Oh yes! I don't understand what's going on. Alright, Jeffy, are you ready for this? Yeah, let's do it. Uh, okay, someone explain what's going on. Once I put this Dragon Ball with the others, we can summon the dragon, and he'll grant Jeffy one wish. Yeah, our balls have to touch. Uh, okay. All right, Jeffy. Are you ready to see the coolest thing you've ever seen in your life? Yeah. <gasps> what, what, what's happening? The dragon's coming. Uh -oh. Wait, don't chew my ear. <sighs> Hi there. I'm Doofy the Dragon. Oh, everybody bow. Wait, wasn't he on Good Morning America? Shh. And I'm here to grant you one wish. Uh, Jeffy, what do you want to wish for? Um, I wish I had that kid's outfit. Wait, Bill. Oh, sick. Pew, pew, pew. Wait, you stole Jeffy's wish. Yeah, you snooze, you lose. Yeah, now we're definitely going to fight. Now I'm going to spirit bomb you. Yeah. Oh, no, you don't. Not if I spirit bomb first. <laughs> Will Jeffy get revenge on Brooklyn Guy for stealing his wish? Does Brooklyn Guy have any powers whatsoever? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Jeffy, what are you doing? I'm trying to pull my head off, Daddy. <laughs> Why? I don't know. <laughs> well, Jeffy, stop it. You're going to hurt yourself. No, Daddy, my head has to come off. <laughs> Jeffy, it's not going to come off. Stop it. Yes, it will, Daddy. <laughs> oh. Well, Jeffy, you're going to have to sit in it. S stop it, Jeffy. Dang, you're it. 
Jeffy, I'm not playing tag. Tag, you're it. I'm not playing tag. Tag, you're it. Jeffy, I'm not gonna tag, play tag. It. I'm not playing. Tag, you're it. Jeffy, tag, I'm, you're it. I said tag, I'm not. It. Tag, I'm not. Tag, you're it. Jeffy, I'm not playing. Tag, you're it. Jeffy, what was that? <laughs> oh, Jeffy, what was that noise? What? what, what? <laughs> Jeffy! You bust a hole in the wall, Jeffy! Guy, come here. Well, what is it, Jeffy? Tag, you're in. Well, Jeffy, we're not trying to play tag. You, you bust a hole in the wall and you broke your helmet. You broke my helmet? Yeah, Jeffy, you broke your helmet. <laughs> my helmet's broken, Dad. Well, Jeffy, you broke your helmet. I didn't break my helmet, Dad. It's a wall, Dad. Jeffy, you ran into the wall! Jeffy, well, your helmet's broken, so I hope you're happy now. Daddy, I want my helmet fixed right now! <laughs> oh, okay, fine, Jeffy. We'll, we'll try to put it back together. C come on. <sighs> Jeffy, I don't know how we're going to fix your helmet. You broke it into so many pieces. Well, how many pieces, Daddy? Kids, can you help Jeffy find out how many pieces he broke his helmet into? Boo! This sucks! <laughs> Where's Mr. Pig? He's dead! But well, there's four pieces, Jeffy. Four pieces of your helmet. Well, Daddy, you need to fix it. I need my helmet back. Well, Jeffy, aren't you a little too old for your helmet? I think you outgrew it. No, Daddy, because what's going to protect my head when I hit myself with a hammer? Well, just don't hit yourself with a hammer, Jeffy. <laughs> Jeffy, stop it! I can't, Daddy. Got your hat. A uh hat? -huh. Yeah, yeah, like what I'm wearing, Jeffy. Look, 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 let me get you some hats and you can try them on, okay? Okay, Daddy. All right, Jeffy, I got you two hats to choose from the one that I wear and this one right here. One day, I already found a hat. What? Jeffy, you're not wearing that hat. It says, Daddy. I know what it says. Well, Jeffy, you're not going to wear that hat, so take it off. One day, I need my helmet fixed. If you don't give me a new helmet, I'm going to hit myself in the hand with the hammer. Well, Jeffy, hey, stop it. I'm going to go to the store. I'm going to go to the store and try, and try to buy you a new one. Okay, helmets, helmets, do they have any helmets? Oh, they don't have any helmets, are you kidding me? Uh, excuse me, sir, do you work here? Does it look like I work here? Uh, what are you doing here, then? I'm just here for the kids. What? Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know where I'm going to find a helmet at. <laughs> this is so crazy. <laughs> I'm a Tony Hawk. <laughs> uh, hey there, kid. Hi, stranger danger. Oh, no, 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 I'm not, I'm not a stranger. I, I mean, I am, but uh, I, I came over to tell you that I, I like your helmet. What? I, I like your helmet, and I, I would like to, uh, I'd like to buy it from you for twenty dollars. I just want to buy your helmet from you. What? I, I don't understand, mommy. Oh, no, 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 don't call your mom. Um, uh, you, you like soda? Yeah. I, I got a lot of soda at my house. If you come back to my house, oh, oh okay. <laughs> we can work some all back. Okay, okay yeah. <clears throat> There you go, there's your soda. My mommy says I'm not supposed to have soda because your sugar makes me crazy. Well, your mom doesn't know what she's talking about. Soda's good for you. Look, look, try it. Okay. Uh, did, did you like it? Did, did, did you like it? <laughs> Calm down. Okay, okay, can, can I buy that helmet from you now? Uh, kid? Kid, are you okay? Kid? Kid? Oh, oh no. Oh no. He's not breathing. Oh no. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah, but, but the kid that has it, I think he's dead. I, I don't know what happened. Dead? Yeah, yeah I, I gave him a soda, and then he started running around, he started screaming, and, and then he just passed out. And he's not breathing. I don't even know his name. I, I don't know who he is. Breaking news, we got. There is a child that has gone missing. He has probably been kidnapped. Let's go to the press conference. Hello, everybody. Yes, it's true. A child has gone missing. He is eight years old, and his name is Patrick. He was uh, skateboarding outside of his house when he was allegedly abducted. Uh, if you find Patrick, please do not give him any sugar or soda because he has very bad ADHD. And if you find him, please call 911. Now let's put up a picture of Patrick here. Bam! My baby! Somebody please save my baby! Ah! Jimmy! Jimmy! Okay, let's do CPR! Uh, 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 come on, Jimmy, help me! Uh, uh. I think he's dead, Danny. He's not dead, Jimmy, we do CPR! Uh, 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 Okay, Jimmy, uh, try to get him to breathe, try to get him to breathe. Oh, uh, hello? Peekaboo! Ah! Wow, I didn't think I'd 
I got you that good. Uh, w w what are you doing here, officer? Oh, I'm looking for this missing kid. He lives right across the street from you, and uh, he went missing earlier today, so I was just wondering if you'd seen him. Oh, has this seen that kid? Yeah. No, no I, I haven't seen him. Hey, guy, he's still not breathing. Uh, Jimmy, why'd you come downstairs, Jimmy? Uh, who, who is not breathing? Uh, my, my, my grandpa, he, he's not breathing. Look, uh, oh my god, does he need help? Should I come in? Uh, it's fine, he doesn't need to breathe. Oh my god, it's a picture of your grandpa. <laughs> I didn't know he was missing. <laughs> hey, mister, he's upstairs. Uh, Jimmy, shut up! Uh, shut up, Jimmy! Oh, uh, okay, what? I, I, I'm coming in. I don't, I don't know what's going on. No, 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 it's fine. All right, what's going on in here? Uh, uh, what is that? Oh, these are grandpa's clothes. What? Those look exactly like the clothes that the missing kid has in the picture. Uh, no, 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 I bought those at the store. Uh, oh, so you're telling me you haven't seen this kid at all? Uh, no, 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 that, that kid? No, 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 I, I, I haven't seen that, 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 that kid. <laughs> Hmm. I just think it's really suspicious that you have the exact same clothes as that missing kid. <laughs> Chief, what are you looking at? Uh, uh, me, me, what, what am I looking at? I, I wasn't looking up there. I, I was looking at your tie. Really? You like it? Yeah, yeah. Who, who tied your tie? Oh, I, I, I tied it myself. Oh, you tied it yourself? I, yeah. Is it raining? No, you're getting me thawed. What? what? <laughs> what? Did, did you just punch me in the face? Uh, yeah. That took guts. That took a lot of guts. Not a lot of people would have the guts to just punch a cop square in the face. I, yeah. I respect that. What, what? Yeah, yeah, you keep an eye out for that kid and you have a good night. <laughs> You're out of all! Oh, kid, I thought you were dead! No, I just passed out from all the sugar. Well, how about this? How about you get, you give me the helmet, you take your clothes, and you get out of here. Well, what will you trade me for my helmet? Well, trade you for, for your helmet? I already gave you a soda. Well, you gotta trade me something for my helmet. <sighs> Jeffy, what should I trade him for his helmet? Uh, how about your hat, Danny? I'm not gonna give him my hat, Jeffy. Why? Uh, what, what do you want? Well, anything I want? Yeah, sure, anything you want. What do you want? <laughs> okay, I want some cookies, and I want some sour candy, and I want an ice cream cone, and I want a Happy Meal, and I want a Blue Eyes White Dragon, and I want a Walmart shopping cart. A Walmart shopping cart? Uh-huh, yeah! <sighs> Okay, okay, so I got you a Happy Meal, I got your cookies, I got your sour candy, I got your Blue Eyes White Dragon, and I got you your ice cream cone, and your Walmart shopping cart. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. So can I please have that helmet? Okay! There you go! <sighs> Alright, Jeffy, here's your helmet back. Oh, thanks, Dad, you got my helmet back now. Yeah, so don't break this one. Alright, so you can take all your stuff and you can leave, okay? Okay, mister! <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> okay, uh, you got all your stuff, so uh, you should probably get home. Your mom's really worried about you. Okay, thanks for the stuff, mister. <laughs> You're welcome. <sighs> well, Jeffy, today was a really weird day. Just please don't break your helmet again. Um, Daddy, why did Grandpa forget his clothes? Wait, wait, he's forget his clothes. Uh, hold on, that, that might be him. Hold on. Uh, hello? Yeah, hi. Uh, did I just see the missing kid walking out of your house naked, pushing a shopping cart full of treats? Uh, 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 uh. That took guts. That took even more guts to hit me a second time right as you were about to be arrested. Yeah, you have a good night. Guys, it's summer vacation! Woo! What are we gonna do all summer? Well, it's a nice day outside. Let's go swimming. Oh, hell yeah. Let me get ready. Oh, dude, I can't wait to go swimming. Joseph, can you even swim? Why would you ask a question like that, huh? huh? Hey, guys, I'm ready to go swimming. Yes. Check out my summer bod. Whoa, Cody, you're ripped. Yeah, it's because I've been doing an extra 200 sit-ups every morning. I wish my body looked like that. Well, take your shirts off. Let me see your abs. But we don't have abs. <laughs> of course not. It's not easy being a brick wall like I am. So, guys, where are we gonna go swimming at? Oh, dude, let's go to the river. Wait, aren't there snakes in the river? Dude, one time I went to the river, and then the leech went up my pee hole and I pee blood. Yeah, we're not swimming in a river. Does anyone else have a place we can swim at? I wish I had a pool. Oh, I know a guy with a pool. I sneak in it all the time. Are there leeches in his pool? No, it's clean. So let's go swimming in his pool. But what if we get caught? Oh, he's never there, dude. Yeah, let's, let's go swim at that guy's house. Come on, guys. Okay. All right, guys, the coast is clear. Let's go. Come on, guys, get in the pool. Okay, I'm about to. Man, this pool is so cool. Joseph, do you know who owns it? No, dude, I've never seen the guy. Hey, what are you hot little kids doing in my pool? Ah, it's Mr. Winkle, run! Ah! No, 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 come back. You can use it. No, oh, damn, I came on too strong. Uh. What's wrong, Marvin? It's summer vacation, and I know Jeffy's going to annoy me for the next two months. Hmm, what we need is something for Jeffy to do outside to distract him all summer. Like a basketball goal? No, Marvin, like a pool! Baby, pools are expensive. Yeah, Marvin, but do you want Jeffy to annoy you inside or be outside all summer long so we can be alone together for the summer? Hmm, that is a good point. Oh, man, the thought of spending money is making my stomach hurt. Look, you call a pool company and get a quote. I got to use the bathroom. Okay. 
Hey there, thanks for calling Brooklyn Guys Handyman Services. I can do literally anything, except pay child support. <laughs> That's a little joke in case my ex-wife calls. Y you're not my ex-wife, are you? No, I'm not. Okay, good. So how can I help you? Well, my husband needs you to do something for us. Okay, what is it? He needs you to... Uh, oh, oh, I'm having a blonde moment. I can't think of it. Okay, well, just describe it. It's, uh, we need you to fill a deep, wet hole with liquid. <laughs> oh, okay, it's one of those kind of calls. Wait, and you said your husband wants my help with this? Yes, he wants you to do it. Oh, I get it. He likes to watch. Okay. I mean, he will watch if you don't take too long. Oh, believe me, it won't take long at all. Oh, so you're quick? <laughs> I'm a little too quick. I'm Speedy Gonzalez over here. Oh, that's great! But really? Where have you been all my life? Lucky man. Hmm, I'm trying to think of it. It starts with a P. I can tell you what it is. Oh, no, don't tell me. It'll come to me. It'll come to me. Um... Yeah, it will. People get in it. Yeah, and I hope to be one of them. People, uh, multiple people at once. Oh, Jesus, H. Christ. Uh, uh, like, how many people are we talking? Oh, a whole party. A, a whole party? Oh, my God. This has happened? No, we want it to happen. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I got some buddies. I can invite them over. Yeah, let's do this. I'm still trying to think of it. Um, a snorkel could come in handy. Oh, you bet your ass it will. I'm going to be down there for a while. I'm going to have to breathe. Uh, you need lots of towels. <laughs> Oh, damn. Yeah, I will. It can be slippery. Oh, I hope it is. Some people drown in it. Oh, yeah. Why do you think I need the snorkel? Other people use toys. Oh, oh, it's a pool. It's a swimming pool. I I'm sorry, what? It's a swimming pool. We need you to build us a swimming pool for the summer. Oh, God, I am a sick bastard. Of, co of course it's a pool. You said snorkel. Oh, yeah, okay. Uh, I'll be right over. A actually, you know what? It won't be me that comes over. It'll be somebody who, who sounds like me and looks like me. But you can't see me. That doesn't matter. Look, uh, when the guy gets there, just don't even talk about it, okay? Let's forget this happened. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, I'll be right... Uh, I mean, he'll be right over. Okay. Hey, Morgan. What? You just wait outside the bathroom. Yeah, I came to get your house payment. Oh, my, my house payment. Uh, I, I don't have it. Shocker. Look, I need to ask your permission for something. Is there any way that I could possibly get a swimming pool? Huh? You can't even afford your house payment. Why would I approve you for a swimming pool? Well, you see, my son would love to swim in it. Yeah, and I would love to swim in your house payment, but I never get it. Well, listen, listen, is there anything I can do? I, I just really want to buy a swimming pool for the house. Hmm. Now, if I let you get a swimming pool and you pay for it, and then when you default on your house payment, then I can come and take your house and sell it for more money. So on second thought, yeah, you can get a pool. Oh, thank you so much. But there are a few rules, so come with me so I can explain them to you. Oh, okay, so what are the rules? You're only allowed to have a small, boring pool in your backyard. The Homeowners Association hates fun, so your pool can only be five feet by five feet, okay? Absolutely no slides. If I see a slide going into your pool, you're done. Well, what about a small slide? No slides, okay? Okay, I got it. No slides. No, there will not be a single slide, okay? Okay. Marvin, what took you so long? Goodman was waiting for me outside the bathroom. Oh, what did he want? He wanted our house payment, but he did say we can get a pool. Oh, that's awesome, Marvin. Yeah, did you call the pool company? I did. He seemed really excited. Well, that's good. Hey, I'm not the guy that was on the phone. That guy's weird. Oh, you sound just like him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we get that a lot, but I'm not him. That guy's a creep, and I'm not him. Did she fill you in on the phone? Yeah, she told me. So you can build a pool? Oh, oh boy, can I build a pool. I, I, I build pools in my sleep, yeah. So when's the last pool you built? Uh, yes, yesterday. Yes, yeah, I made a pool yesterday. Can we see a picture of it? No, cause that that was a, a secret pool for the CIA. It's a CIA secret pool. So have you built other pools in the past? Can we see a picture of those? No, no, I, I've only built secret CIA pools, so I'm, I can't take any pictures. They, they, they actually would have me killed just for talking about it. Whoa, whoa, did you see that bullet, that quiet bullet that just went over? That was them trying to kill me for talking about all their pools. So the CIA just has a bunch of pools? Yeah, yeah, they love their pools almost as much as they love how secret they are. So so we're going to be your first civilian pool? Yeah, my first non-secret pool. That, that'll that be cool. I, I'm used to building pools next to aliens and, and, and nukes and stuff. So... Okay, anyway, we have, these are things we need. The pool has to be five feet by five feet okay. and no slides. Oh, well, that's easy because I don't even know how to make a slide. Okay, and the pool has to be in the backyard. Okay, oh, oh really? Because I'm used to building pools like in secret underground bunkers, you know, so this will be different. So I'm going to show you my backyard. Come on. Okay. This is the backyard. Oh, yeah, this is the perfect place to build a pool. I, I would totally build a pool here if I could. But you said you could. I can. I can build a pool, so that's that's what I'm going to do. Well, then start. Um. Okay, I guess I'd start by uh, d d d digging a hole. Yeah, dig a hole. Dig a hold yeah i'm gonna do that so um just uh there you go um i i, I don't want to do it while you're watching I, I can't do it when people are watching okay 
Okay, I'm gonna call somebody who knows how to build a pool. Okay, here's your pool. Jesus, wow, that, that is one hell of a pool. Man, that is, that is just outstanding work. I don't know how you people do it. I, I mean, people who make pools. I don't know how people who make pools do it. I, I don't get it. That's mind-blowing to me. Okay, can I get paid? Oh, well, see, I can't really pay you until the guy that hired me to build this pool pays me. See, I'm lying, and a guy hired me to make a pool, but I don't know how, so I hired you to make the pool, and so now I need that guy to pay me. Okay, it's gonna be four hundred thousand dollars. What? Jesus, four hundred thousand? Well, I didn't sign up for that. Hell, I don't even think he signed up for that. Well, if you don't pay me, then I'm gonna bury you with the shovel. Uh, okay, uh, y yes, sir, amigo. Oh, oh man. Okay, I'm done with the pool. Already? He did say he was quick. Well, no, 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 no. That was that was the guy on the phone. I, I didn't say that. I'm not. I'm not him. So the pool's done? Yeah, come on. But uh, walk backwards. I want it to be a surprise. Uh, okay. All right, turn around. Look how big this pool is! What happened to five feet by five feet? No, that's kind of hard to translate into Spanish. What? Uh, nothing! Look at that big slide! A slide? I said no slide! Oh, yeah, you did say that, didn't you? Oh, I'm sorry, it must have slipped my mind when I thought about how badass it would be! I mean, look at that! Look at that thing! It's cool! It's fun! I know it's cool and fun, but the Homeowners Association said no slide. <laughs> them! What do they know? What are they, allergic to fun? They gotta be like 65. What do they do on the weekend? Croquet? They're too old for fun. Look at these palm trees. They scream youth. Alright, listen, the slide's gotta go, because they're gonna be mad. Okay, well, if they have a problem with it, tell them to come talk to me, because I have something long and wet they can suck on. That slide. Okay, listen, the, the slide's gotta go. Okay, man, listen, listen. How about you just pay me, and then we'll talk about the slide after. Okay, how much is it, like $20,000? Uh, like $800,000. $800,000? I didn't agree to that! Yeah, well, I didn't either, but look how cool this pool is! I do not have $800,000 to pay for this dumb pool. Okay, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to fill it in with dirt. Then fill it in with dirt, because I can't pay for it. Okay, listen, man, I got a problem. Um, can I talk to you inside? Why can't we just talk out here? Because I, I don't know if he's listening. Come on. Well, who? In here, in here. Well, what's going on? Okay, look, man, I'm gonna be honest. I didn't build that pool out there. There's no way in hell I could build a pool that nice. Then who built it? I don't know, some guy I found? Well, let me talk to him. I'll pay him. Oh, see, that's the problem. He wants $800,000. Well, let me talk to him. I'll tell him we don't have that money. Well, see, I told him that, and he said he'd kill me if I didn't pay him. Hola, gringo. Oh, God, please don't cut my head off. You have my 400,000 pesos? What pesos? 400,000? You said it was 800,000! Well, yeah, I was trying to get my cut. Cut for what? Well, for finding him. He made a really nice pool. I was the middleman. That's gotta be worth something. How many dollars is 400,000 pesos? About $20,000. Oh, okay, great. So just pay us 40000 and I can still get my cut. Get out of here! Okay. okay, uh, baby, can you grab the plot convenient money that we don't tell the Goodman about? Okay, Marvin. Here you go. Arriba! Muchos gracias! Now we have a pool and it's paid for. <laughs> <laughs> Joseph, how did you not know Mr. Wiggle owned that pool? Dude, I never see him! Look, there's a sign that says skinny dip in the pool, so I always skinny dip there. Plus, there's cameras pointed towards the pool, but he never comes outside. Because he's probably watching the cameras. That's so gross. Now where are we going to go swimming, guys? We can go swim at a community pool. Ew, no, Junior, that's gross. People pee in public pools. You know what? Actually, yeah, let's do it. Hey, guys, when did we do a swimming pool in your backyard? We don't have a swimming pool. What are you talking... <laughs> There's a pool! Guys, guys, there's a swimming pool in the backyard! What, Junior, pools don't just come out of nowhere. Well, that's when dead cabalas go! We do have a pool now! Oh, dude, it's so sick! What, Junior, how did you just magically get a pool? Maybe Santa Claus brought it. Well, Santa Claus can't bring a pool. Well, yes, he can. He's magic. He can't fit 30,000 gallons of water in a bag. Maybe he has 30,000 bags in his sleigh. Well, his sleigh's not big enough. Maybe he has, like, a limousine sleigh. Got a new one. Well, Junior, stop it. You're just not in the Christmas spirit, Cody. Well, no, because it's June. You're... Is my name. <sighs> Alright guys, last one in the pool is a big fat ugly mom and is a cow. <laughs> oh man guys, I could float in this pool all day. Oh gosh, I can't <laughs> Yeah, this pool's really nice. Yeah, this is awesome, dude. Wait, why'd you guys get in the pool fully clothed? Because we're not comfortable with our bodies, Cody. Yeah, Cody, we don't have six-pack abs like you. Yeah, I kind of know how you feel. I left my shoes on. Why'd you leave your shoes on? Well, because I have bowling people feet. What's bowling people feet? Well, it's where my toes are all crooked, like I've been wearing bowling shoes. Ooh, I like feet. We know. What? Hey, guys, is that a slide? Oh, guys, we should go down it. Ooh, I bet you won't go down it naked. No, but I'll go down it fully clothed. Oh. All right, guys, I'm going to go down the slide. Here I go! Whee! You guys see me? Oh, sorry, Junior. We weren't watching. We were trying to see who could hold their breath the longest. And Jeffy's winning. Yeah, he's had his face underwater for over two minutes. Go, Jeffy, go! Okay, baby, I'm gonna go get Jeffy and show him the new pool. Okay, Marvin. Hey, Marvin. <laughs> Ask me why I'm pissed. Why are you pissed? Come with me. What the hell is that? Oh, this is my pool. You told me I could get a pool. Yeah, no, I'll address that in a minute. I'm talking about what the hell is that? Oh, th those are twirly stairs. You climb up them. And what's connected to the twirly stairs? 
a twirly slide. And what did I say about the slide? Well, doesn't it look cool, though? It's going to look real cool being torn the fuck down. Well, well, don't make me tear it down. Tear it down. What? No, no, listen, 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 the kids are going to love it, and it looks so nice, right? I'll tear it down. Well, don't, don't, don't. Well, no, 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 please, please don't tear it down. I told you no slides. The Homeowners Association does not like fun. Well, well I, t tell them I got something they can suck on. Excuse me? Th they can suck on this big, long, wet slide. I'm going to hit you with this. Oh, okay, listen, look, we'll get rid of the slide, okay? We'll get rid of it. All right, well, let's go inside and talk about how your pool's not five feet by five feet. Uh, okay, yeah, it is. All right, Marvin, pull this. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. And stop. That right there is five feet. And if your pool's bigger than five feet, just by an eighth of an inch, I'm gonna bite your areola. Oh, okay. All right, the tape measures at five feet. And look, it's the length of the pool, we're good. Let's put it down, shall we? Looks like it's longer than five feet, dickhead. It's a little longer than five feet. Uh-huh, get your bald ass inside, I'm gonna deal with you. Uh, Jeffy, what are you doing in the pool, get out. Mm -mm -mm. Marvin, I don't know what I'm going to do with you. You just don't listen. It's like you're five years old. I tell you to build a pool five feet by five feet, and you put an Olympic-sized pool in your backyard. I tell you absolutely no slide, and you put a big McDonald's ball pit slide back there. Well, listen, I, I tried to follow the rules. Tried. Well, try harder next time, Marvin! Oh, okay, listen, look, can I keep the pool? You can keep the pool, but that slide, that slide's gotta go. Oh, you know what, bend over! Well, why? You're getting a spanking. I don't, I don't want to spank, I'm a grown man. I don't care, you've been a bad boy, bend over! Ow, that was my back! I don't care, get over it! But what you're gonna do right now, is you're gonna go take a hammer, and you're gonna hammer that slide down, right now! So I can't keep the slide at all? No slide for you. You can keep the pool, but no slide. Okay. This is a real problem. They really won't let Logan keep that slide. So you just gotta get rid of it. Hey Marvin, your phone's ringing. I know, I can hear it, it's right next to me. Okay, fine. Hello? Uh, hello. This is Jackie Chu, Jeffy's teacher. I was calling to tell you that Jeffy gonna be getting her report card today, just in case he doesn't show you. All right, thank you for warning me. Who was that, Marvin? It was Jeffy's teacher. Let me know he's getting his report card today. Ooh. Ah, Daddy, help me! I was playing on my shirt and it started eating me! It was not eating you, Jeffy. Ah! Look, 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 it was just stuck. All right, thanks, Daddy, for saving me from the big bad shirt monster. Well, look, Jeffy, your teacher just called me and let me know you're getting your report card today. So don't try to throw it away or anything. You have to show me. Okay, Daddy. Well, there's not going to be any bad grades on it because I'm the smartest boy ever. Well, look, if there's a single F on that report card, your life's over. You're grounded for a year. Okay, Daddy, but there's not going to be any F's on it. Oh, look, get to school. Get your butt to school. Oh, just my butt? All right, can you help me take it off? Well, no, get your whole body. Just get, go to school. All right, Daddy. <sighs> All right, class, today, before we get started, I'm going to hand out your report cards. Here you go, Penelope. Here's your report card. All A's, yes. Junior, here's your report card. Only one F? That's a new record. And Joseph, here's your report card. Oh, dude, I finally did it. All F's. You know how hard it is to do that? Joseph, that's very impressive. <laughs> Thank you. And Cody, here's your report card. All A's. I knew it. You know, sometimes I get tired of being so smart. Maybe you should get all F's like me. <laughs> I'm good. All right, Bori, here's your report card. Eh, whatever. I'm just going to be a trash man like my dad anyway. And Jeffy, here's your report card. Oh, oh no, all F's. My daddy's going to kill me. Oh, oh. Guys, guys, I got all F's on my report card. High five. No, because my daddy told me he was going to kill me if I got a single F. Well, I don't have parents, so... Well, Jeffy, why don't you just take Cody's report card home and say it's yours? Wait, no, that's not going to work because my report card has my name on it. And besides, I save all my report cards because I want to get into a good college someday. Oh, and my mom gives me Zerberts on my belly for every A I get. What's a Zerbert? It's where she blows on my tummy and I'm super ticklish. God, I hate you, Cody! But guys, for real, my daddy said he's going to kill me if I get an F on my report card! That's it, Jeffy. Why don't we fake your death? Why don't we call your dad and say you died at school today and he'll never see you ever again? But no, Junior, that's a terrible idea. Doesn't that seem kind of extreme just to avoid getting punished? Well, my daddy said he's gonna kill me anyway, so we might as well do it. Okay, I'll grab my phone. All right, All right guys, it's ringing. Aren't they just gonna look at the caller ID and see who it is? I blocked my number, Cody. Shut up. <sighs> Baby, can you answer the phone? Sure, Marvin. Hello? Hey, I mean, hey, this is Officer Tells Bad News Johnson. I'm calling to inform you that your son Jeffy died today at school. What? I know, you seem very upset. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. What happened? Well, um, Jeffy and another student were playing tag during recess, and Jeffy fell into a pile of ants. And then a plane crashed, only killing your son. The ants are fine, though. They're fire ants. They were normal ants until the fire from the plane explosion turned them into fire ants. But uh, he's dead. Oh my god! Is it gonna be on the news? 
Uh, no, it won't be on the news because the owner of the news, Sir Isaac Newsten, was the one flying the plane, and he didn't have his pilot's license, so he crashed his plane, and that will make the news have a bad name. So we just don't want anyone to know about it. Yeah, so he's dead, so you'll never see him again. I'm so sorry, bye. All right, guys, they totally believed it. Sir Isaac Newston. Who do you think invented the news, Cody? I don't know. Sounds believable to me. Thanks, Joseph. So my parents really think I'm dead? Yep, they think you're dead, so you don't have to go home and show them your report card. Sweet. But wait, where is Jeffy going to live? Because he can't go home. Oh, you're right. Jeffy doesn't have a place to live. Hey, Cody, can you stay with you for a while? But me? I don't want him living with me. But it's your fault that we had to do that whole phone call thing. Well, how is this my fault? I told you it was a bad idea. Because you wouldn't let us borrow your report card. Well, I would have rather you taken my report card than have him live with me. Well, look, it's your fault, so now you have to let him live with you. But why can't he live with Joseph? Dude, I live in a cardboard box. <sighs> okay, fine. He can stay with me for one night. Come on, Jeffy. <laughs> what? Baby, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Jeffy, no! What? What, say it without crying. Jeffy died. What? Well, why are you so calm? You told me to calm down. Wait, but how did Jeffy die? What did they say? It was a plane crash and fire incident. A plane crash? A plane crash? Really? That sounds like a prank call. Let's call the real cops and see if it's true. Okay. Hey there. Somebody call the cops? Oh uh, yes, officer. We got a call from another officer saying our son died today. Oh well, who is the officer that called you? Officer tells bad news, Johnson. Really? Officer Tells Bad News Johnson? No, that's just ridiculous. Officer Tells Bad News Johnson retired 20 years ago. This is probably a prank call. A prank call? Baby, what else did the call say? Well, there was a plane crash, and the guy flying it was Sir Isaac Newston. Sir Isaac Newston? No, that name's just silly. Yeah, this is definitely a prank call. Well, why would somebody want to fake our son's death? Well, did your son have something big coming up that maybe he was trying to get out of? Well, he was getting his report card today. Yeah, I bet that's it. I bet he got a bad grade, and he faked his death to get out of it. Why would Jeffy do this? Because he didn't want to get grounded. Thank you for helping us, officer. Okay. Yeah, I just, um, guess I'll take off. Just, uh, just leave. Honestly, I really don't want to go. Well, you don't have to leave. Oh, okay, cool. Thanks. What about our son? He'll probably come home, baby. He has nowhere else to go. <sighs> yeah, so, um, what do you guys want to do? I, I mean, there's nothing to do. Find our son. Hey, you want to play slap hands? But what's that? Well, try to slap my hand. Ha <laughs> ha! Gotcha, loser! <laughs> well, you try to slap my hand. Okay. <laughs> Easy loser. Oh, no, no, let me try again. Okay. Nope. Nope. Marvin. Nope. Nope. Marvin. Nope. Marvin! What? Call me Jeffy! Well, I gotta try to slap his hand. Nope. 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 Oh. Ow, ow. Okay, that's it. You're under arrest. You're under arrest. Ow, 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 ow. Uncle, uncle, get off me. <sighs> Okay, Jeffy, you can only stay here one night and then you have to go. Okay. Now, look, my parents are a little weird, so just ignore them. All right. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. Now, would you look what the cat drugged in? Hey, Dad. Ooh, Cody, who's your sexy friend? Meow. Hey, woman, keep your eyes on me. I'm the only one that can cheat in this house. Yes, Daddy. Well, uh, guys, this is my friend Jeffy. His parents kicked him out, and he needs a place to stay, so can he spend the night? If his parents don't want him, what make you think we do? Now, Tyrone, that's not how we treat our guests. So what's wrong with you? You some kind of junkie or something? You gonna hurt our little Cody? Yeah, what you got? What you holding, huh? Huh? No, no, no guys, he, he's not a junkie. He just needs a place place to stay, so can he spend the night? I guess so, Cody, but I don't want to hear any of that loud rap music after midnight. Yeah, this is a jazz household. We don't like that rap music. <laughs> oh, and Cody, dinner's gonna be ready in a few minutes. We're having pierogies and party pizza. Ooh, pierogies? Oh, we feasting tonight, baby. So you and your friend go wash your hands and feet. Okay, Jeffy, welcome to my room. What, Ken, cover yourself up, you dirty, dirty boy. We have company. Sorry about that, Jeffy. Ken just doesn't know how to act around company. I think he needs a spanking. Hear that, Ken? I'm gonna spank your little plastic tush. Boy, you little weird old dinner's ready. God. Come on, Jeffy. Boy, will you hurry up? I'm hungry. I'm here, Dad. Wait, wait where's Jeffy's food? Oh, Cody, your friend's not eating at the table with us. Yeah, his plate over there in the corner on the floor. Wait, why? Well, we don't know where he's been. He might have rabies. Yeah, he like a stray dog. Well, I go to school with him. He doesn't have rabies. Cody, don't argue with me. I'll smack you. Uh, okay, uh, I'm sorry, Jeffy. You have to get on the floor. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. Hey, hey, hey! Don't touch that food we haven't said grace yet. All right, everybody bow your heads. Dear God, thank you for this delicious food. And thank you for not letting any of my side chicks get pregnant. Oh, thank God for that. Mm-hmm. 
Thank you for good health and a short refractory period. Amen. Amen. That's just a beautiful prayer, honey. That's how prayer should be, straight from the heart. Mm -hmm. I meant that. Okay, Cody, eat your food. Wait, Mom, what is this? It's a pierogi. Eat it. You're going to grow up big and strong. Yeah. Big boys got to eat their pierogies. Oh, I hate eating off the floor. So, boy, how was school today? Yeah, Cody, did you learn a lot of new stuff? Well, we got our report cards. Oh, my God, Tyrone got all A's. Great googly moogly. You know what that means. Zerber time. Oh, um, I'm done. Hey, 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 shut the hell up. It's Zerber time, boy. It's Zerber time. Let's go to the bedroom. <laughs> okay, Cody, let me see that belly. But mom looks so ticklish. <laughs> <laughs> nah, baby, give me some Zerbers. I need some. <laughs> I love Zerbers. Ooh, mom, one more, one more. Uh oh, give me some more, baby. Give me some. <laughs> come on, mom, come on, do another one. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck is going on? Come on, baby. Yeah, I need some. Ooh, <laughs> so ticklish. Oh, I want to go back home. All right, Marvin, your turn. Hmm. Oh, you're so done. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, you did not just do that. You just lost. Check it out. Oh. Connect four, I win. I, I, did, I mean to put it right there. <laughs> you suck. I wish my wife sucked as much as you. She's really good at connect four. She beats me every time. We're playing again. Can we please go find Jeffy? Baby, look. Jeffy faked his death. He has nowhere else to go. Eventually, he has to come home. Oh, hey, you know what would be funny? Whenever your son comes home, you should pretend you can't see him like he's a ghost, you know, because he's dead. That'd be so funny. That's so mean. That's what we're going to do, baby. Whenever Jeffy gets here, we're going to not talk to him. We're going to act like he doesn't exist. <laughs> Oh, wait, look, let's answer the door and act like we can't see him. Okay. Uh, hello? Hey, Danny. I'm sorry I faked my own death. Baby, there's no one at the door. Do you see anybody? I sure don't, Marvin. Daddy, I'm right here! <sighs> Must have been a prank. Some kid rang the doorbell and ran away. I guess so. Why can't you see me? I'm right here! <sighs> I wish Jeffy didn't die. Me either, Marvin. I didn't die! I'm right here! Let's go upstairs, baby. Okay. Daddy, daddy, daddy! Who's at the door? Is that your son? Yeah, play along. Okay. Danny, I'm right here! I miss Jeffy. I miss him too, baby. <laughs> I'm right here! Hey, I know you're going through a lot with your son dying and all, but I'm ready for the funeral. We're ready for the funeral too. Funeral? We don't need a funeral because I'm alive! I'm right here! Okay, here's his tombstone. Oh, oh the no. tombstone! And here's his body. Oh, not his body! Oh, no! That's oh, no. not my body! I'm alive! I'm right here, oh. Danny! I'm right here! I can feel his soul trying to contact me. Oh. Okay, you ready to start the ceremony? Yes. All right, we're gathered here today to be sad about the death of Jeffy, who was taken away from us too soon. We don't usually question God's plan, but today we ask, why, God? Why did you take this young man away from us in such a tragic and comedic way? Why? I curse you, God! Amen. Would anyone else like to say a few words for Jeffy? I would. Jeffy, if you could hear me right now, we love you. We wish we could hear your voice one more time. I'm right here! Here's my voice! Ah! Ah! Settle down. Calm down. That, that's, that's enough of that. Uh, let, let, let's just have a moment of silence for Jeffy. I pooted. You folks have a nice day. I'm right here! I'm right here in front of you! Wait a minute. I, I think I hear Jeffy from the great beyond. What, you do? I think so. Jeffy, are you there? Yes, I'm right here! Right in front of your face! Oh, I, I, I can hear you, Jeffy, but I'm the only one. Is there anything you'd like for me to tell your parents? Yes! Tell my mommy and daddy that I'm sorry I faked my own death. Okay, he says that he's not sorry and he would do it all again. What? what no! We... I'm right here! Look, we can see you, okay? What? Jeffy? What? Daddy, you can see me? Oh, Jeffy, you're back! Oh, oh I'm so sorry, Daddy! daddy. I'm oh, so daddy. sorry! I'm so sorry I faked my own death! I just didn't want you to see my report card! What? Why wouldn't you want us to see your report card, Jeffy? Why don't you go get it? Oh, okay. All right, Daddy, here's my report card. All Fs, Jeffy! Well, I tried my hardest! No, you didn't! You did not try at all! These are all Fs! We're gonna need another funeral after I'm done with him. Well, funerals aren't cheap. <laughs> What? A school play? I love theater. I hope I get the lead role of the wolf. How? Dude, that's a horrible wolf. But I should be the wolf. He blows houses down and I love to blow things. You're gonna be a pig just like your mom, Cody. Ha! Like mother, like son. All right, Penelope, you're gonna be a pig. Ha ha, 
down, you're gonna be a pig. Settle down, settle down, Crass. Junior, you're gonna be a pig too. Well, uh -huh. Ha ha, Junior, you dork. I don't wanna be a stupid, dumb pig. All right, Joseph, you're also gonna be a pig. Aw, oh, this sucks. Oh yeah, that means I get to be the wolf. I knew it, I knew he'd see the greatness in me. And Cody? You're gonna be a tree. What, a tree? There's not even a tree in the story. Well, that's where they get the sticks from. What? what? And Jeffy, you get to be the big bad wolf. Oh, I get to be the big bad wolf? I'm in your huff, and I'm a puff, and I'm a blow your house down. <laughs> What do I get to be, teacher? You get to be the insurance adjuster that files the claim for the two blown down houses. Yes. What? Jeffy gets to be the big bad wolf? Oh, come on, teacher. Jeffy couldn't blow his own birthday candles out of his life depending on it. I am a professional blower. Do you want me to come up there and show you how good I am at blowing? Settle down, Cody. The role that you are assigned is the role that you have to play. There'll be plenty more school plays in the future. So go home, study your lines, and be here tonight for the parade. Make sure you invite your parents. What lines? Am I trying? Tree. Trees don't talk, they just stand there. Calm down, Cody. At least you didn't get cut from the play. <sighs> Junior, that's not funny. No one asked you, Cody. That wasn't a joke, that's just how he says ask. Wait, I said a joke? Uh, all right, come to my house and study your lines, Cody. What, what lines? Guys, this is so cool. I know, right? We're gonna be like real life actors. Does this costume make me look fat? Everything you wear makes you look fat. Ugh. Guys, this is bull crap. What's wrong, Cody? My script just says stand stage right. I don't even do anything. What do you expect the tree to do, Cody? I didn't want to be the tree. I wanted to be the wolf. Stop being a sap, Cody. Yeah, learn to branch out and play other characters. Aw, guys, leave him alone. See, why can't I just make tree puns like that? Then I'd at least be saying something. Because trees don't talk, Cody. Look, the only cool thing about this tree costume is that it has a spot for my junk. Oh, look, Cody, we have to go over our lines. We have to know this by tonight. All right, start at the top. This sucks. Our parents kicked us out of the house. Threw us right in the mud. Mom doesn't give an oink about us. What? I want to make sure you're doing your job right. No, I know how to stand still. It's not that hard. All right, guys, I think I know our lines. Let's go to the play. We didn't even go over the whole thing. Oh, my God, Cody. Do you not know what you're supposed to do? No, I, I know what I have to do. All you have to do is stand there. I wish I had an easy job like you. No, Junior, I know what I have to do. See, you're the root of the problem, Cody. Yeah, root of the problem, like a tree. <sighs> this is so dumb. No, it's not, Marvin. We need to be here to support Jeffy. It's just a dumb elementary school play. We don't have to be here. Yes, we do, Marvin. It's art. Hey, my son's the tree. Yeah, he gonna be the best damn tree out there. I guarantee it. Okay. Whoa, this set looks so cool! Yeah, dude! What, what the hell is this? There's already a tree here! What's the point of me? See, this is how useless I am! I can be replaced by a piece of paper! Calm down, Cody! Yeah, you're distracting us and we're trying to go over our lines! Alright, kids, the show starts in one minute, so don't rip me down! Uh, where am I supposed to stand? You're a tree, Cody. You stand right there. You don't move. <sighs> Jeez, I hope I remember all of my lines! Oh, look, my dad's here! Oh, good, and my parents are here, too. I know my dad's looking down on me from heaven, or up from hell! Ooh, guys, guys, the, the, the show's starting. Get, get your lines, get your lines. Oh, thank God it's starting. Let's get this over with. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the stage, The Three Little Pigs. <laughs> this sucks. Our parents kicked us out of the house. Threw us right in the mud. Mom doesn't give an oink about us. So what do we do now? Well, we... We are pigs. We are pigs. Don't have a home. Don't have a home. Gotta build our own. Gotta build our own. Do, do, do. do. We, we, we are pigs. We are pigs. Don't have a home. Don't, Don't have a home. home. Gotta build our own. Gotta build our own. But where are you gonna get the supplies to build a house? Did that tree just talk? He wasn't supposed to. Shut the hell up, Cody! I just wanted to say something. But trees don't talk! I know. Well, guys, we need to build us a house. Sure do, dude. But what should we build our house out of? I think we should build our house out of straw. No, dumbass! We should build our house out of sticks. Sticks? Did someone say sticks? I have sticks. I'm no, a Cody, get back in your spot. I think we should build our house out of bricks. Well, we can't decide on a material. Ooh, I have an idea. We should all build build our own house. That's a good idea. Okay, we will all build our own house. Just make sure you don't hog all the materials. <laughs> and done. I just finished building my house out of straw. Home sweet home. Rawr, I'm hungry for some piggies. Ah, it's the big bad wolf. He's known for eating piggies. I'm gonna hide in my house. I bet there's some piggies in this house. There's some piggies in this house. There's some piggies in this house. Hey, piggy, let me in. Not by the hairs of my chinny chin chin. Well, I'm a huff and puff 
and blow your house down. No, please don't do that, please. Ah! You blew my house away, why would you do that? It looks like I'm eating bacon tonight. Well, first you gotta catch me. That's not even what a wolf sounds like. Oh man, I love my new house made out of sticks. Ah, Joseph, I mean Piggy Brother, help. What's up, dude? The big bad wolf just blew down my house. Well, I could have told you that would happen. You made your house out of straw. Can I please stay with you? Sure, dude. The big bad wolf can't blow down my house. It's made out of sticks. <clears throat> I said, the big bad wolf can't blow down my house. It's made out of sticks. Come on, dumbass, speak! Whose son is this? Jeffy forgot his lines. No, he didn't, Marvin. He's just nervous. You got this, Jeffy! My son doesn't forget his lines. Your son doesn't have any lines. Jeffy, say your line. Jeffy, you have a line to say! Say it! I have to pee. Piss your pants! Say your line! I'm hungry for some piggity! Ah! Go inside the house! There's some piggies in this house! There's some piggies in this house! Hey, piggy! Let me in, not by the hairs of a Shut up, Cody. Well, I'm a huff and puff and blow your house down. No, please don't do that, please. Ah! Wait, why would you do that? It ah. looks like I'm eating bacon tonight. Ah! Oh man, I love my house made of bricks. Ah! What's wrong? The big bad wolf blew our houses down. Can we stay with you? Sure, the big bad wolf can't blow down my house. It's made of bricks. She's a brick house. Anybody know that song? <clears throat> the big bad wolf can't blow down my house. It's made of bricks. Well, call me Wrecking Ball, cause that bitch is coming down. Jeffy language. <gasps> Daddy, you made it to my play? Daddy, look, I'm the big bad wolf. Th that's real nice, Jeffy. Just focus on the play. You want to hear what the big bad wolf sounds like? <clears throat> that's not what a wolf sounds like. Uh, Jeffy, please just say your lines. Jeffy, say your lines. Okay, I'm hungry for some piggies. Ah, I want inside the house. There's some piggies in this house. There's some piggies in this house. Hey, piggies, let me in. Not by the hairs on our chinny chin chin. Well, I'm a huff and puff and blow your house down. No, you can't do that. Ha. I told you he couldn't blow down my house of bricks. I guess brick was the best material. We're saved. The end. Wait, that's how it ends? Oh no, I'm gonna get me some piggies. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, 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 ah. Well, now that everyone's distracted, it's my time to shine. Tree. Shut up, Cody. All right, everyone, that concludes tonight's show. Everyone give it up for Jeffy the Big Mad Wolf. And the three little pigs. And the tree. Yeah. All right, thanks for coming, everyone. Woo! Bravo, Jeffy. Yeah. Jeffy did so good. He destroyed the set. My son rocked the hell out of that tree. Yeah, you saw how he shaked them leaves, baby? I did.